arguments. So earth supports of light, that is lesson number one. Yeah. Girls, be very, very thorough with the vocabulary terms. Read them, the highlighted part inside, read them three to four times. What is photosynthesis? What is atmosphere? What is UV rays and what is ozone? I will revise with you now, listen to it carefully. When I say photosynthesis, you must know that plants are photosynthesis. And this is very important. What is happening during the photosynthesis? Oxygen and glucose is given out. Again, plant convert carbon dioxide and what if not highlighted, highlight today. 138, plant convert carbon dioxide and water to oxygen and glucose. This equation is very important. Please okay. note the equation that carbon dioxide and water is taken up with the plant to give oxygen and glucose. And they use energy from sunlight to perform photosynthesis or to make their own food. Next girls, what is the next vocabulary we have? We have the next vocabulary as? Atmosphere. Atmosphere, it's a mixture of gases that surround the planet. What is an atmosphere? It's a mixture of gases that surround a planet, moon, or other space objects. Take a paper, write all the vocabulary terms of three lessons, and just read it two to three times. That's enough. Okay. UV rays, girls, it comes from sun, which can harm our life. UV radiation, it comes from sun that can harm life. What is ozone? Again, very important. Girls, I told you that See, from the sunlight, from the sunlight, from the sunlight, if imagine, if imagine girls, actually it is sending this UV light, UV light. UV light is which color? It's somewhat purple in color. This is purple color, okay? But because of, there is one layer called as ozone, ozone. it is called as Ozone, ozone layer. Now, ozone layer, the formula is what? It is a molecule that contains three oxygen atoms. Dana? Dana, Zishan. See, what is the formula of water? If I ask you, you will say me it's H2O. What is ozone? What is ozone? Everyone, please listen to this question. Ozone means oxygen, but how many oxygen? Three atoms of okay. oxygen. Oxy ozone is a molecule that is made up of three oxygen atoms. Some human made chemicals have damaged because we damaged girls, we damaged this layer. Imagine after many years, if this, this chemical comes inside, this purple color chemical that is ozone, sorry, UV light, if it enters, it's very harmful, very fatal. Imagine if the whole world will be not yellow in color, it will be purple in color. Okay. This was about. Listen, also study the ozone. So, for photosynthesis, atmosphere, UV, that is ultraviolet radiation, and then we have ozone coming to you. Plants produce glucose and oxygen during the process of photosynthesis. Earth, what absorbs solar radiation? Good. Earth's atmosphere absorbs solar radiation. Okay? This is for yeah. lesson number one. Coming to lesson number two, if I come to lesson number two, that is natural resources. Okay. Energy from the sun can be used to make electrical energy. Girls, you know that the sunlight, that solar energy, can it be used to make electrical energy? True or false? True. True. Very good. 
Okay, next. All of the earth resource will last forever. Will everything last forever? False. No. False. Fruit, cloth, robe, these all come from plants. True. Human activities mm. can negatively affect girls. If you are not using properly, it can affect the resource. Earth. Once again, read all the vocabulary terms. Let me come to vocabulary terms. That's true. Do the vocabulary terms, the lesson review at the last, and the first page, true or false, it's enough. A natural resource is any natural material which we use, renewable resource. It can be replaced at the same rate at which it is consumed. As soon as we consume, it is being replaced. Uh, it, is, it is replaced, but very slowly. A fossil fuel is a non-renewable resource. Girls, very important again. What is a fossil fuel? It's a non-renewable. Um, what is a coal? Non-renewable. Non water? Non water, girls? Renewable. renewable. You have to know the difference between, anyways, non-renewable chapter, sorry, renewable chapter, the next lesson is not there, but you must know the difference, girls. Material resources, natural resources that are used to make object, food, or drink. Any resources through which we make food or object, I mean, these are natural resources like cow, we get milk, that is a natural resource. Natural resources which give us energy, they are called as energy resources. Natural resources that those that give us energy or any object they give energy, those are called as energy resources. Research. All the vocabularies. This turbine, you don't have to just read it out once. You don't have to know much about it. Coming to here. What are fossil fuels? It's a non-renewable non -renewable buried remains of animals. What is a resource? Any natural, no, a resource used to make object, food, or drink. Natural resource, any natural material used by people. People. And these answers, just question number four and five, if you do, that's enough. Question four okay. and five, read and understand. coming to non-renewable resources. When I say non-renewable, you know that I'm talking about coal, fossil fuels, petroleum, gasoline. Remember those? Yes. Yes. So we have, what are the vocabularies here? We have... Energy resources. We have energy resource, nuclear energy, fossil fuel, and Vision. Energy resource is a natural resource that human use to generate energy. What is a fossil fuel? Non-renewable resource that forms from remains of organisms that lived long ago. Nuclear energy, when nuclei of atoms are split combined, it's called as nuclear energy. When you split an atom, it is called as nuclear energy. Again, energy. examples are very, very important. They can ask you in multiple choice. Natural gas, is it renewable or, uh, sorry, non-renewable or renewable? Coal. Non-renewable. Non non Alhamdulillah, we did a lot in the class also. I made you, each girl, tell me again and again. So I feel that everyone can answer inshallah. Dash is an energy in an atom's nucleus. In the nucleus of an atom, we have nuclear energy. Crude oil is a liquid kind of a fossil fuel. This is a fossil fuel. There is something which can be both renewable and non-renewable. That is during the process of fission. The nuclei, I said you, fusion is different. Fission is different. During fission, the nuclei split into two or more to form 
smaller nuclei. So this is all for science. And uh, do you have any other questions, girls? No. Or no. Anything what you don't understand, you want me to explain once more? Nothing? No. Good luck. Do well, girls. Take care. Okay.